How you doing, YouTube family? Man, Ant Man here, back with another video. Um, I just was on a wonderful, wonderful call. Um, wasn't really expecting this call today, but I definitely uh, am glad that he did contact me. So we're in the process um, of building a wonderful partnership. Um, and let me tell you uh, what what he has put together. I'm not taking any credit. Uh, what he has put together is something that is pretty, you know, pretty amazing. I mean, it really is. Uh, the price points is different, uh, very inexpensive, and it's just it's something that all of you can use, okay? But on the marketing end, this is where I come in at. I'm coming at with all the marketing, uh, the approach, how to say it, what not to say, uh, targeting those uh, that need it specifically and coming up with something specifically to say to each one of these uh, business professionals in their specific fields, okay? So we are coming up with something that's amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna keep you guys posted on what hey Ant Man got going on, and uh, definitely, am, definitely, am looking forward to uh, this wonderful partnership that we are uh, are trying to build here. But okay, <clears throat> what I wanted to make this video for was to just say, like you know, technology is the wave of the future. You have to understand that. If you're marketing one way, you're losing. Okay. If you're just doing postcard marketing, you're utilizing maybe a distribution company or something like that to get, you know, the ball rolling, you know, which is okay in most cases if you're just trying to target your local market. Okay. But when you have something like an amazing technology that you can utilize to not only help build the growth of, of, of your business, but potentially um, help others as well grow their own companies, I'm telling you right now, that is something that you're going to want to broadcast across the board, all 50 states, Canada, you know, China, you know, everywhere. You're going to want to get this thing booming, okay? It would make better sense to offer your opportunity to more people across the world because you have that reach uh, than just, you know, staying close to your own local market. I mean, if that's what you want to do, then that's fine, okay? But you don't want to limit yourself, you don't want to limit your commissions, and you don't want to limit the amount of people that you can help. So let's just say you're from Florida, or you're from California, or you're from Pennsylvania, and you're only just targeting those that are in your local market, your reach is very limited because it's only one state. Okay? You, a lot of times, what people have at their disposal, <clears throat> excuse me, is something that so many people can utilize for their business, but you just don't know who needs it until you send them a message, okay, via voicemail or text message, okay? Understanding what's trending, understanding what's working, uh, voice messaging systems work. Text message marketing services work. All right? They work. I could say paper advertising and stuff like that, you know, that works, but to an extent, okay? I'm here to tell you, nobody in this new age reads a newspaper. It's the truth. I don't care what statistics you see. Nobody my age reads a newspaper. Nobody necessarily in their 30s reads a newspaper. Maybe somebody in their upper 40s and older reads newspapers or looks forward to getting the paper. But there's no box on every corner with a newspaper stand. There used to be. There is none now, okay? Now, I've been around the block a couple of times. I'm here to tell you, you don't see it like you used to, okay? Because these uh, paper advertising industries are understanding that, you know, if they don't come up with something now, they're they're actually getting uh, they're getting booted out. I mean, it's, it's just the truth. It's the plain old truth, okay? Uh, just like Uber took over the transportation industry as far as taxis. Taxis tried to sue Uber because Uber is now just taking over, okay? Amazon took over the space and where... Uh, you can go online and you can buy a TV instead of going into Walmart. You know, you don't have to go anywhere to buy anything at all, anywhere. Uh, software, tools, uh, everything is usually automated. You can just download a plugin on someone's website. Uh, you can just click the download button and uh, all of this amazing stuff starts popping up on your uh, computer. Uh, I mean, technology is the wave of the future, guys. I mean, you have to understand and you have to accept it. Everybody is, there, is in their cell phone, okay? Everybody is in their cell phone, all right? It's just, period. That's just the way it is. 98% open rate in cell phones, okay? 95% with voicemail, okay? People are getting 
uh, very, very much so into the new age of technology and why not utilize the same approach to your business? I mean, am I right? You can't go anywhere without somebody uh, having a cell phone. You can't. Okay? So being that they have a cell phone, why not utilize that, that, that cell phone to send a message to their voicemail that they already have in their phone? Okay? 67% of people actually sleep with their cell phones and 47% of people um, actually check their cell phones on a daily basis to see if they actually get text messages or messages in general, period. Okay? It could be notifications. Uh, via email, um, it could be text messages, it could be voicemails. People who got their face dead in their phones. I mean, I've seen a girl with her stroller with her baby in there and she actually almost got hit by a car because she was so involved and distracted by what was going on her phone that she didn't even pay any attention to what was going on. You're driving up and down the street and you can tell that, uh, you're beeping the horn, you're in front, you're behind the person and you're like, what are you doing? The light's green. They was in their phone, you know, or they was listening to a voicemail. It's the truth, okay? I've gotten voicemails, you know, on my phone and, you know, if you're driving or, you know, if you're in the passenger seat, you know, you pick it up, you know, right off the bat, you're going to pick up the phone and you're going to listen to it. Technology. If you're doing paper advertising, somebody would have to go, you have to be at the house in order to get it. You get those, you know, postcards in the mail, you know, make this, you know, X amount of dollars from home in a day. You look at it, and the funny thing is my dad, he gets those uh, postcards in his house um, all the time. And he rips them up, and he throws them in the trash. So that was enough for me to, um, that was enough for me to see that, you know, I didn't want to go that route. You know, I didn't want to go that route because, you know, I'm not saying that it doesn't work, and a lot of, Big companies still utilize postcards and they, you know, they make Instagram cards for people and, uh, posters and flyers and all that great stuff. I'm not, I'm not knocking it. I'm not. Okay. But I mean, it's like a 2% chance and probably less than 1% chance or something like that. Somebody's actually going to look at that postcard and actually take action. Like, you know, you can look at it, you can read it, but then they put it down and call it a day. So you can have to do four or five times the amount of advertising to get someone interested in your opportunity because each and every time you either throw your postcard in the trash or they just put it down and then go to something else okay nobody is waiting for postcards in the mail nobody's waiting for, for you know paper advertising they're not waiting on that they're waiting on their check if they get paid that way you know they're waiting to get a bill but they're not necessarily waiting on a postcard or nothing like that okay um I'm just saying it's just the truth okay and I actually, uh, you know, was speaking with someone that, uh, is, has been doing, you know, postcards and this, that, and the third. And he started using, you know, technology. And he said, you know, in my day, uh, he's a little older gentleman. He said, in my day, um, you know, ads in the newspaper and that guy on the bike rolling around, you know, throwing, you know, the papers on the step. He was the man, you know, he was advertising for a company and people was getting a lot of cash that way. But now, the way the world is shaping technology is the wave of the future and if you don't take advantage of this technology you will fall behind like you will fall behind in your marketing and your advertising getting your opportunity out there okay i can now post as many videos as i want and get 24 7 advertising just on youtube alone and it's free okay it's free i mean why not utilize why not use this big avenue that we have i don't pay youtube youtube can pay me but i don't pay youtube I just post whatever I want. It's crazy, right? I'm telling you. I don't know why people don't use this avenue. Okay, okay. Utilize technology. Understand the, the understand the trends that we are. You know, understand the times that we are in. This is trending. Not just do it because it's trending, but it's working. People are people have been affected. Period. Okay. Get with SMS marketing. Get with uh, voicemail advertising. You know. Uh, um, Get with video marketing, okay? Those are like the three main things that you are going to want to do because at the end of the day, I don't care if you got the best website in the world, you're driving the best car in the world, it does not matter what you're doing with your business, whether it's a brick and mortar business at a physical location or it's an online business, okay, from home, web based, desktop based, whatever you want to call it. Nobody's going to see it if you're not doing the right marketing. Period. Nobody's going to be able to see it. It does not matter. This person's pickle on this side, maybe, um, uh, 
less uh, pleasing or, you know, this this person may have something that's that's not as good as your opportunity, but yet you're not promoting your opportunity the correct way. Okay, this person over here is promoting his opportunity in a, in a more, in a better way, and he's getting his opportunity out there, which is turning uh, those customers into clients, and further on down the road, he can promote to them whatever he may want to, because he's promoting the right thing, but he's really promoting uh, the, the best way, you know, that works, okay? Voice messaging system is not necessarily new, but it's not old either, okay? Uh, voicemail drops, okay, it's fairly new a little bit, but not new, new, but it's fairly new. Voice broadcasting, get out of it, don't do it. Uh, text message marketing is still sort of new. I mean, you hear about text message marketing about even five or six, seven years ago, but it's really starting to take its wave, you know, into the, you know, into people in businesses being able to utilize text messaging and, uh, you know, voicemail drop systems and this, that, and the third. So I just wanted to make a quick video to let people know, like, hey, you're going to want to utilize technology to get this, to get your opportunity out there, not just, you know, writing on a postcard and just sending things off and, you know, waiting for the, you know, the bird to come down with the basket. Like, we are in a new era, okay? Take advantage of this new era that we have. Do not, uh, I wouldn't say waste your time, but don't spend too much time just doing something that, you can handle, you know, most people want to do something that they can handle, like right? far as knowing that they sent out 500 postcards or, you know, knowing that they got a team out there sending out flyers and this, that, and the third, okay, you can have a team of 10 people and they all got, what, uh, 250 postcards or 50 postcards a piece, okay, you know, it's 500 postcards went out or whatever, but yet, I mean, 500 flyers went out, right? Posted them all out, okay? But people walk up and down and pass these flyers all day long. And I'm not saying that that doesn't work, okay? But even people in real estate don't necessarily do this like that no more. They keep that avenue open, but they have so much more uh, things that they do of advertising, not just that. So all in all, don't just have one way of marketing, okay? You want to have the best way of marketing, which is voice, uh, which is voicemail drop systems, text message marketing platforms, and video marketing. Word of mouth advertising is one of the best ways. Still, doesn't matter if it's traditional or not. But you're not going to be able to speak to, you know, ten thousand, five hundred thousand, a million people. You're not. You don't have that capability. You don't even know a million people. To be honest with you, you don't. But technology has a way that you can send your opportunity to those millions of people. So why not take advantage of the technology that we have of today and grow your business as big as you can get it, okay? I want to thank you guys for watching my video. I want you guys to take care and I want you guys to always, God bless. I love you.